Hello, people. I'm Vito, and welcome back to Fire Emblem Radiant Dawn with Robberlink. Hello. All right, where we left off, we had finished the first stage. We met Micaiah, Edward, and Leonardo, as well as some uh, ruthless Benyon soldiers who seem to be oppressing the Dane people. Yep. All right, and we're in the middle of this exposition segment, so if you'd like to unpause and listen. Here we go. Early summer. The northeastern nation of Dayan lost a bloody war with neighboring Crimea three years ago. Crimea, however, abdicated its right to rule Dayan and passed sovereignty of its former enemy to the powerful Benyon Empire. Dayan's future is now subject to the whims of the Empire. I don't rem remember it having an echo. Benyon's occupation forces have gathered all day in men of fighting age and put them to work in labor camps. Their work is brutal and void of purpose, designed to break both body and spirit. The remaining population faces poverty and starvation as the fields lie fallow. A band of young heroes has escaped the Benyon army to form a group called the Dawn Brigade. Fighting for a free day in, they alone have stood against Benyon's forces. They alone have shouldered the hopes of their nation. Among the company is a young girl named Micaiah, who is said to possess mystical powers. The people of day in have come to know her as the Silver-Haired Maiden. They have come to think of her as the savior for whom they had been waiting. Benyon's forces have tried time and again to capture and silence the Dawn Brigade. However, Micaiah's ability to sense impending danger has thus far allowed the Dawn Brigade to evade the Empire's grasp. All right, chapter one, Maiden of Miracles. All right. I was thinking, it's nice that we don't have to voice those long exposition segments, but also I don't get to do like a cool voice. I know, right? <laughs> How should we explain yesterday to so the Nolan? It's like you said, we didn't have a choice. We had to save Nico and the townsfolk. I kind of already forgot what voice I gave you. I thought it was a little bit deeper. I tried. I thought I tried giving him like a bit of an accent, and like it's been like five minutes, and I've forgotten what it was. I don't know. It just sounded kind of formal. But I admit, getting spotted by those Benyon soldiers was unfortunate. Still, I'll do it again, all over, or I'll do it all over again, one way or another. <laughs> those words they still made sense. The worst part is, they know we're near. Wait, the worst part is they know we're near. They could find this hideout as easily as they found our last one. I just don't get it. This is our country. Why do we have to live in hiding like prisoners in our own land? Come on, you know why. We lost the war. And Crimea won. It's not our country anymore. End of story. Except that Crimea walked away after winning, leaving those heartless Benyon dogs to rule our country for the last three years. Also, if there was any question how much time passed between the last game and this game, now we know! Exactly three years. The occupying soldiers march around like they own the place, doing whatever they want, and no one dares to stop them. To be fair, Crimea didn't have the resources to rule another country. So, and no one too. Welcome back. I'm glad you made it in one piece. At last, the Dawn Brigade is all present. But you are, uh, but you are unusually late. Where were you delayed? So I don't exactly remember what voice I gave him before. Well, but fortunately, he, he's, he's grown, grown up. up. Yeah. <laughs> so we can just blame it on puberty. <laughs> I think our fame's catching up with us. Benyon patrols are everywhere. It took us a while to avoid them. I've never seen so much Benyon activity in this area before. Is there something we should know? Um, well, actually, the truth is... We killed some people. That's it? That's not so bad. 
Ah, ah, that's what did it. You had a run-in with bandits. And Benyon's soldiers spotted us as we made our escape. I'm sorry, we only wanted to help. We were careless. We'll worry about that later. More importantly, Micaiah, were you seen healing anyone with sacrifice? Oops. <laughs> I'm afraid so. You can't allow anyone to know what you can do. Healing without any tomes or staves is a rare gift. Almost unheard of. I wonder if that would have actually changed if we hadn't used it, but probably not. Because I also realized you could have just used the healing items. Yeah, possibly. If anyone saw you doing it, you'd be given away immediately. And I don't know if I could keep you safe. Yeah, my thought is always, if we have a healer, do the healing, because that'll give experience. As yep. opposed to an item, which is just a waste of money. <laughs> I know, Soth. I know you know, but you keep doing it. This place isn't safe anymore. We should leave at once. Correct. Ah, but it would have been nice to eat just one meal in peace. No can do. An alley in Nevasa. This way's no good either. Benyon's soldiers have every alleyway blocked. A kitten couldn't sneak past them. Well, it's a good thing we're not a kitten, then. <laughs> it looks like this really is the least guarded path, then. Even so, it's swarming with soldiers. There are more coming up behind us. We'll be trapped if we don't move quickly. We can't wait for Soth. The stairs by the church lead to the marketplace. We can break through there. I'll go first and secure the way. Micaiah and Leonardo, cover my back. Remember to keep your distance from the enemy. Team up and bring them down one by one. We'll be careful. Leave it to us. Edward, you bring up the rear. Your skills have improved, but you're still new to fighting. Don't rush the enemy. Just focus on surviving their attacks. Got it? Yeah, yeah, I got it. Okay. Is that a door I see to the left? Gasp. We must visit. Do it. Knock, knock. You there. You must be... Ah, you needn't say a word. I see the goodwill in your eyes. Take this and go, quickly. You've done so much for the inn's poor. It's time we did something in return. Don't mind how silly my voice sounds. Just take this funerary. I swear, it's not poisoned. <laughs> huh, so you actually have a turn limit. Indeed I do. Hopefully it won't be that bad, though. Alright, uh... Ranges? Alright, so... What I... level is Nolan? Is he... Okay, oh, he's nine. Yeah, so then... Defense nine. Okay, so then what's the the opponent's general attack damage? Nine for strength is attack though is sixteen. Okay, so they could still hurt. Hmm. So yeah, I don't know if you want to put him that far or not, but it's up to you. Hmm. Uh, I think we can handle it. All right. If not, I can blame you because you're in control. Exactly. I can blame you legitimately this time. And then, Edward, go here. I was kind of hoping you'd be able to move one tile further. <laughs> That's fine. And now he's dealing with axe wielders and not... Oh, well, that was a javelin, though, so he could fling. Yeah. I was just thinking about the weapon triangle because uh, lances and spears are good against swords, but... Hopefully, this should be fine. If not, oh well. Captain Isaiah. I think it might be Isaiah. I Isaiah? Isaiah? I think. Captain Isaiah, just as you said, 
A group that appears to be the Dawn Brigade is storming the alley. I'm just thinking it, Isaiah is a name that exists. So uh -huh. I wonder if they're just making like a fancy spelling of it because I don't think that's how it's normally spelled. Hmm. I'm just guessing though. How generous of them. I'll wipe them out and advertise my exploits to our commanders back home. All right, here we go. But why'd the camera change and then snap immediately back? I don't know. It's like, I'll go to this position now. Oh, wait, he can attack again. All right, back to focusing on the action. All right. <laughs> All right, he's fine. Because the accident hit him. Oof. Yeah, but that could still kill him in one more turn. All right, so if, do you want to just... Hmm. You can't have Micaiah heal Nolan because that's in range of the uh, the javelin. So if you want, you yeah. could maybe have him use an item. If he doesn't have one, he can take one from Edward. I don't know. I was thinking of... Uh... Hmm. Well, unless you think he's still fine, but you should probably definitely just... heal... Hmm. Just make sure Edward doesn't get killed, is all I'm saying. Yeah, I'm aware. I think I can make use of the fact that um we have herbs and vulneraries and the with fact ridiculous amounts of usage. Yeah, and the fact that no one here can miss, apparently, on your side. Later on, it's more of a problem, but at the moment, your team seems to have always 100% hit chance. Which is usually how it goes in the beginning of Fire Emblem games. Here, eat this leaf. I was thinking about that, like, hmm, leaf. Like, wait, that's disgusting. Uh, yeah, just kill him. Yeah, and there's only one left that can hurt him, probably. Since no one else has moved in yet. Poor Leonardo has been left out of all this action. He barely got action in the last uh, stage, and now he's behind because he was the one who went to visit. <laughs> and you're dead. Yay. See, I can do it without cutting off my arm. Like, quick, he's distracted, worrying about not cutting off his arm. I can hit him now. All right. What do you got? Oh, dang. You actually got skills. Yeah, he had 98 chance to hit back. Practically 100. So you can get XP here. <laughs> Unless you miss. It's like, hey, wait, that's my kill. I was busy twirling my sword. <laughs> well, this should teach you not to do that. Uh, if I want to move Edward here. Uh. I was thinking maybe attack that guy in front of the door from the left with Nolan, and then maybe have Micaiah use sacrifice and then have Edward go into the house. Uh, yeah, I think that'll work. Thank you. You are welcome. Time to get axed. I just wanted to ask you a question. <laughs> I was thinking about that too. I'm like, is that too dumb? It is. <laughs> what? So let's just get out of the way. It happened and we will never speak of it again. Wow, Makai is kind of just about kill herself. I hope no one has range. There is an archer up there, but I checked. He doesn't have range. Enough range, yeah. yeah. Unless he moves. In which case, we're doomed. Also, does Makai have a healing item? Uh, if I think not, so. If not, you could just take one from Edward. Yeah. Those beasts. They do whatever they want in our country. They're even sending our clergy to their awful camps. But I'm helpless. I don't have your strength or courage. This axe, you should have it. But I don't use it. Hand X. Okay. Good a time as any to learn. 
That's another thing about three houses, is apparently anyone can learn any weapon. I do kind of like the idea of that. Like, maybe it just takes them longer to learn to begin with a new mm. weapon, but then you can kind of do whatever you want with the characters. So I don't hate that idea. Like, I would... I would, ex I would expect and understand if, like, there was one particular weapon they already knew how to use to some degree when you get them. Right. That it'd probably be better to stick mostly with. And then if you wanted to give them, like, a secondary thing. But then, but then anything other than that, unless you're going to waste a ton of time <laughs> to get them good with every weapon. Right. Like, you get to the, like, the last level, and then you start, you just keep doing skirmishes until... A, a, a particular character that you love gets every weapon like to max level. Where are we just gonna ignore that Leonardo got a one skill level up? Oh, uh, did he? Yeah. yeah, I wasn't paying attention. Oh well. Also, I do believe this game lets you save in the middle of battles, hmm. not just suspend. So if you ever feel like you know things are getting dicey, but you're in a spot you could probably still get out of if you're lucky. You could always save. All right, then. This won't kill him. Hmm. I think that's probably intentional because he's your highest level unit at the moment. So if he doesn't kill someone, then he can leave them at low health for other people to get easy experience. True. Although that he'll probably attack Nolan again next turn and get himself killed. Well, now he's a bowman. Oh, a bowman? Okay. Uh, hope. Those guys don't move. Hopefully this is okay. Not this is gonna be awkward. Mm, yeah, that's pretty likely. Ouch. Mm, no, I guess they're all just rooted in place. Okay then. So maybe have Edward attack the guy up. Not, yeah. not Nolan, Edward. Because uh, I was thinking if you move Edward, you can have either one of your ranged units attack the archer from range. I mean, it's up to you. Whatever you want. Yeah, I think I'll do this. Hmm. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, that could work. I do know I don't usually analyze it as much as you do, unless someone's already hurt. Unfortunately, this is pretty early in the game. So I can't, like, I can't be like, oh, I know these guys are capable. It's like, eh, everyone's kind of good, but are they good enough? Everyone's still sort of noob, and you need to get used to their abilities. Yeah. Well, he's already fast enough compared to someone else that he could attack twice if he needed to. But he don't. Yay. Weapon level up. Um. All right. Yep, that'll work. Give it to Micaiah. She might actually get a good level up, as opposed to Leonardo. Whoosh. I like that little bow at the end. <laughs> and so I smite the enemies. Amen. Or something. All right. Nice. And he's dead. Now then. So there is one more house to the left, right? There is. Or no, there isn't? Okay, I thought there was. Sorry, my bad. Don't mind me being stupid. Alright, I won't. <laughs> Let's just move on. You... Yeah. Move up here. And eat a vulnerable... However you say it. Eat your medicine. And then... How does this go? Not okay. Gr not great, but also keep in mind there's the hand axe. 
Oh yeah. Then again, it's an axe for his sword, so he should be fine-ish. If you eat another one of these. Eat your leaves! Always eat your vegetables. Your greens. I don't know. And meanwhile... Step aside. The girl we've been looking for. The lucky little escapee. Too bad for you, sweetie. Your luck ends today. I have but one thing to say. No. No. I think, may, should we change it to nope? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> nope. When it's a crit. Yeah. Also, when, like when it initiated that uh, combat camera, it's like, what do you mean I can't fight back? <laughs> There's nothing in between us. Oh, jeez. Uh, oh, yeah, maybe don't do that. <laughs> I'll just have him wait. Okay. What fast little mice you are. How uh, how long do you plan on scurrying around in back alleys? Uh, hopefully no more than two turns. What? <laughs> yeah. It's like, what's a turn? Oh. Ah, I knew it. <laughs> I knew it was a bad idea. And he's dead. <sighs> Dang it, and I was doing so well, too. Oops. Uh. <laughs> and you didn't save either. I thought the beginning was supposed to be easy. It kind of is. Game over. Wow, I didn't think it would actually do that to you <sighs> if it wasn't Micaiah or Soth. Oh, well. Hmm. <laughs> I was like, are you sure you want to put him in range of two people? But you didn't care. You're like, ah, they'll be fine. You didn't even calculate it out, did you? No, because usually they're good enough to survive level two. No, this is level two. This is level one post prologue. <laughs> <sighs> All right. Well, I think we'll um. Do a bit of this, and then we'll come back for the yeah the last bit of this episode. So we will see you in a bit. We're back to about where we were before. Yep. <laughs> before Edward frickin' died. And I have learned from my mistake. I'm going to do this. Okay. Now then. <laughs> before we do anything stupid, we've saved. So stupid stuff will not happen again, at least... If it does, there will not be... As big a consequence, although yeah. the fighting did go much smoother this time, I feel. Yeah, I'm not sure. Hm. Yes, yes, scurry we do. But we also bite with arrows. What? Cancel. Hold on a moment. I don't remember what that does. If that was the enemies, then it may have canceled a second attack, but I don't know. Yeah. Okay, then it was something you did. Well, that was <laughs> <laughs> that was unnecessary. What was he gonna do? Good to know that he has it, though. <laughs> well, what do others have? 
combat related skills. Okay, when he's at low health, more crit, but he also has crit that I think is tied to his class. Huh. Okay. Hmm. So there you could leave him and he'd be safe. Because he can only be attacked by that guy. Right. But if you initiate the attack, he could get killed and uh, you can't have Micaiah heal him because Micaiah would then be in range of him. And she's also at low health already. So why are you why are you still at the screen? I think I have an idea. Bit of this. Okay. Wow. <laughs> yeah, Wrath activated to show you, yeah, he'll have more crit, but it didn't actually crit. Okay. And now... I just realized I probably should have checked before, but, uh... That could work. Handy DX. Uh, very well. That looks like it'll work. Whack. Good thinking. I don't know if you'll get maybe more bonus experience if you take less turns. I think probably, but... Oh. Oh, now you move. Step aside. Please. <sighs> Good thing we saved. Yep. Ouch. You know what would have been awesome if he missed? <laughs> and then had another attack and still missed? I'm sorry. I can't go on. South. Micaiah, no, you can't die. Not in a place like this. Please, listen to me. Micaiah. She disappeared. I really don't like this. <laughs> yeah, I spent so long looking forward to this. Resume. Game, please, just let me enjoy my childhood once again. <laughs> uh, okay. All right, do you want to just leave Edward in front of Axe Thor dude and then Nolan in front of the main dude? Sure. Isaiah or whatever. Like without attacking. Right. If Nolan has enough HP and defense, he could maybe attack, but... Okay, so... Just be safe. I'll... Yeah. Okay. Uh... How much would this hurt you? Probably a lot. Yes. Okay. And I assuming cancel isn't guaranteed as useful as it would be. Yeah, probably not. It's probably a luck based or whatever. So, Specifically their luck stat or skill stat is usually what it depends upon. So let's do, just do this. But it is nice the fact that we can just load up a save as long as we remember to save. Yes. Uh, like, uh, it would have been really helpful that one time that I moved Marsha in a bad spot. Oh, yeah. And she got hit by an arrow and insta-killed. Nice. He's free experience now. And even if that hits, it can't kill him. This is fine. <laughs> so who shall get the experience? Hmm. Honestly, probably anyone but Nolan could use it. Um. Okay. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm trying to think. Please tell me you'll do decent here. You gotta get, get, get a good level up. Assume you're even close. Oh no, I've been... No, you're not. Cancelled. <sighs> Cancel culture strikes our god. What? This can't be. I'm in my prime. Not so easily. Ugh. So we just don't tell him that he actually did succeed twice in a row? <laughs> I have the strangest feeling that I should have won this. Actually, wait.
Uh, right. Alright, we're gonna do this. Well, let me just triple check, because this should be work, but... Okay, it'll, do, it'll be enough. Okay. We can kill him. And when he's dead, we won't need to worry about anything killing us anymore. And, <sighs> and then reinforcements come and they get their turn before you. Ah, oh, nice, even evaded. See, it, uh, it just takes a few attempts, and then we get it down right. Uh, those are just practice runs. <laughs> I'm actually good at the game. I just wanted to see some death dialogue. <laughs> That's another thing. I, we, we still haven't seen the game over screen for Mega Man 64. <laughs> huh. I haven't died once. Time to run into cars. <laughs> Uh, that might actually take a bit. I was thinking maybe. What just... if you get rid of the armor? Oh, that could work. I was I was thinking maybe just go to the Gator section, because they <laughs> tore Mega Man apart. <laughs> True. All right. No witnesses. <laughs> Not gonna deal with them. No. They could be worth more experience, but we have a uh, an episode to end. And also only like two turns. <laughs> yeah. Right, there's me. <laughs> Everybody, this way. They're running to the center of town. After them. Oh no, they're following us because... Micaiah's bleeding. <laughs> Good work. I see the market. If we can blend into the crowd, they'll lose us, and we'll be free and clear. Hey, lady. Nico. They're after you again, aren't they? Are you and your friends all right? You still suck, by the way. <laughs> Moldy onions, where'd they go? Sir, what have you got against onions? They're moldy. <laughs> Leave the soldiers to us. Go on now. Get yourselves to safety. Quickly, don't dawdle. You must escape. You're our only hope. Thank you so much. Wait, was that a Star Wars reference? <laughs> Wait, there they go. Catch them. <laughs> don't let them get away with that reference. <laughs> what are you stopping for? W well, they... You won't get past us. We stand by the Dawn Brigade. That's right. God is protected. Dawn Brigade. Wait. Something terrible is about to happen. What is it? I'm about to fart. <laughs> <laughs> In an enclosed alley. Oh, no. <laughs> no, we have to go back. What? You're letting this rabble stop you? Ready your bows. No one defies the will of Binyan. It doesn't even say soldier or anything. It says he's Binyan. Yep. He is the entirety of Binyan. <laughs> no. How could you shoot a child? You vicious savages. Actually, it was quite easy. Someone, someone help him quickly. Please, this child is dying. Pay heed. This is what happens when you meddle in Benyon affairs of state. Remember it well. I didn't realize that Benyon, uh, I didn't realize that the Benyon Empire's affairs of state included murdering children in the street. Don't point your fingers at us. We're just doing our job. If you're upset, blame it on the Dawn Brigade. That'll work. <laughs> yeah, I totally got him. <laughs> they made this happen. Oh, hello. <laughs> we were just speaking of you. It's the girl we're looking for. Call for reinforcements. Surround and arrest every uh, every last one of them. Every last one of them. <laughs> What's happening? What does she think she's doing? Hey, you, step away from that child. Mikaya, no, you have one HP. I killed it fair and square. It's my meat. <laughs> Good lord, these guys are barbarians. <laughs> uh. 
It's like, hey, wait, that was my dinner. <laughs> it, it's a miracle. We've seen a miracle today. That was sacrifice. That girl, she must be the silver-haired maiden. Only she possesses sacrifice. It's a shame she was at only one HP when she did that. <laughs> Stop right there. After them. We can't let them get away. We still stand by the Dawn Brigade. What is wrong with you people? Did you hear me? Clear a path or you'll end up like that kid. I'm fine. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> Meanwhile. Wait. I sense another disaster is about to occur. I need to go back. <laughs> You sniveling idiots! Why are you just standing there? Give chase now! Uh, yes, sir. We would like to, sir, but the townspeople are blocking our way. Oh, I see. The townspeople are blocking your way. You dullards! Block this! Clean out those dirty ears and listen to me. You are soldiers, and I am your commander. You will follow my orders promptly and without hesitation. Understood, you useless vermin? Now move. Yay, I didn't get stabbed like my friend. Unbelievable. If it's not one thing, it's another. Why am I always stuck leading the buffoons? Hmm. Are you awake now? Thank goodness. Do you see? This is why I told you not to use sacrifice. We sure showed them in Navasa, huh? I guess we can't go back there. Not for a while, anyway. I'm so fond of Navasa. It's where we all met. It feels like my only real home. We will return. Someday. We will, Micaiah. I know you. And you have a way of getting what you want. Because you're always there to help me get it, Soth. Can we have a save now? Please. Hopefully right after this. Yes, okay. Because we desperately need to end the episode. <sighs> but, uh, yeah. At least we made it through after uh, two failed attempts. But yeah, we'll have to end it here. And we shall continue this next time. Goodbye for now. Mm, goodbye.